name's Atlanta and welcome to this week's episode of Atlanta Delivers. Today I have travelled to Byfleet which was about an hour and a half away. Ben is doing a Punch and Judy show like a fun day where I am currently on the Byfleet Recreation Ground. So I've just dropped him off with all his Punch and Judy gear and I am going to head off and deliver for Deliveroo and Uber Eats and be livery if anything comes up. I have turned on the app, it's all showing as not busy. It's currently 11.58, so just about to hit lunchtime and it's a Saturday, so hopefully it's busy, but the weather at the minute, we're in a heat wave, so it's really hot. So I don't know if that means less people are ordering. Don't know where I am, never been here before. Um, I think I'm gonna put in my maps like McDonald's or something and just head there and wait, I think is my best bet, but I have no idea how far away that is. Let's have a look. McDonald's, sea locations. No idea what parking's like, nothing. Three and a half miles away. Wow, we're not even near to a McDonald's. 15 minutes away. Chertsey. Maybe I'll have to, oh, in Woking. Maybe I'll have to head out of where I am. No, but that becomes a different area, Woking. Oh, I don't know, let me try and work this out. <laughs> My little brain is trying to process I'm somewhere that I've never been before. Normally when I'm not somewhere that I know, Ben's with me, but I'm literally on my own. I think I'm gonna head to Woking, which I've put into a McDonald's, which has actually no parking. Um, <laughs> it's 16 minutes away, five miles. I think I'm just gonna head in that direction. I'm gonna have to swap delivery area and hope for the best. <laughs> Please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Okay, 12.11 and we are online in the Woking Deliveroo area now. We're right on the outskirts of West Byfleet and we are making our way into Woking. I have accepted my first order. We've made it to Woking for, I can't even remember the name. It's on Uber Eats, but Shins Boba Hump, something like that. I think it said it's an Asian restaurant. Um, no idea on the parking situation. I know nothing about where I am or anything that's going on. Um, there's a delivery rider in front of me. Hopefully it's gonna be somewhere I can park, um, but we're only two minutes, 0.4 miles away, Double Tree by Hilton. It's Woking like a city. I literally like, <laughs> have no idea, but we're nearly there. I'm so lost. The shopping center, is it in the shopping center? Oh no. Oh no, that takes me into a car park. Oh no. <laughs> I have to spin around. Woking shopping. Okay, so it's in the shopping centre, but I cannot get in that shopping centre, I don't think. This might be a fail video. I need to try and... Oh, but look, a delivery driver's going in there. Where does he park? There's delivery drivers everywhere on scooters. Where do they park? I'm going to have to get rid of this order. <laughs> okay, so that order is not going to happen because it's in the shopping centre. And I've accepted a delivery order for McDonald's. I can't believe McDonald's is now on delivery. That's literally mental. This is the first one. I don't know if I'm going to be able to park when I get there either. Um, but it's not in the shopping centre, so I don't know. I don't know what. We're five minutes, 0 0.6 miles away. We're just going to have to give that a go. It's very busy, the roads as well. It's very busy around here. I want to see. I'm literally next to the KFC head office. When I was Google mapping where this is, there was one that was in a Morrison's, a McDonald's, or buy it, and this is it. So that means I can park, yay! Can you park? Actually, I'm getting excited. Yeah, you can park, oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Oh, there's another delivery driver. I'm so happy I can park, oh my gosh. Hey, ah, this is nice. I can't say the wait time's gonna be nice in McDonald's. This is the first ever McDonald's order I've done on delivery. It is, right, let's put we're here. Order is for a large Italian stack meal with a banana shake, large fries, two sour cream and chive dips, a galaxy caramel McFlurry and a cheeseburger. The order is for £4.13, so the drop off, it's not going very far. Okay, let's head in. Might use the toilet if it's not ready as well. I really thought that was gonna be another order that I couldn't park at. Thank goodness it's not. It's a fancy looking McDonald's. They have a separate delivery driver entrance. I've never known a McDonald's like it. It was ready. What the hell? It was ready. I can't believe it. They had like four orders ready. 
I'm literally in shock that the order was ready. They had a separate delivery driver entrance and then all of the orders were ready, none on preparing. That's literally amazing. We have six minutes, 1.6 miles to get to the customer and it's going to Salvation Army and they're meeting me in the car park. So that means I know there's parking. Ah, oh, this is so good. I'm so happy. I thought this video was gonna go so wrong. Well, the first order did and then I thought, oh, this is just going wrong from here. But at least I know this one now you can actually park. There's another two other delivery drivers just waiting, so I don't know if it's quiet or what. Deliver order. Oh, yeah. yeah. You are quite quick. Ah, she gave me a two pound tip. Okay, so we completed the order and she was waiting outside and she was really lovely. And I only saw her after, because I just pulled up and gave her the food, that she also gave me a two pound tip on the app. So that was very kind. So that turned into just over a six pound job. I've set my maps to go back to that McDonald's area as I know I can park. Um, but I have the apps on it showing as moderate. So we'll head that way um, and see if we get anything on the way or we'll go park at McDonald's, but I'm sure something will come up soon. We have an order, but both my Uber and Deliveroo are really playing up. Um, my Deliveroo's come up twice now that it's given me an order, assigned an order, and then it's just not showing at all. And then my Uber, um, I have an order for Ambrose Coffee. It says to park opposite, that, which is why I'm trying to get to now but it's not working with the maps or anything. I'm really not sure what's going on. So I'm just kind of trying to follow the Uber maps, which isn't the easiest thing um, to guess where I'm going. I'm not sure why, I might need to restart my phone because both the apps aren't working. another nice one um they said park opposite on the notes which i have and it's just a small little coffee shop uh, it's for a cappuccino with hazelnut syrup a tuna milk panini and a baklava slice love a little baklava so we'll head in um happy days I have the order, it was just a few minutes wait, but they're really friendly in there. And now I'm only going two minutes, 0 0.4 miles to the customer. Um, they're self-isolating, so they've just asked for me to leave it on the door. And I turn on delivery, it's doing the same again where it's saying there's an order and then not coming up. So I'm going to restart my phone um, whilst I'm sat here. This is really frustrating. That's three in a row that it says that there's an order Bluetooth and it doesn't come up. I'm literally so frustrated. I've even restarted it and it's like, you've been assigned to a new order and nothing's showing up. I'm literally not sure what to do. Maybe I should delete the app and restart it. I don't know if there's a problem with delivery or my phone. This is so annoying. Maybe I'll try deleting the app. <laughs> it's clearly busy and there's orders. I just can't get them. I have no idea what to do. Oh, by the way, I got three pound for that um, Uber Eats order. This might have to just be that I do Uber. So it's like the order should be there and nothing's coming up. I'm gonna head back towards the McDonald's and I guess I'll just be doing Uber Eats for now. Sad, I love doing delivery. This is actually driving me insane. It's saying on delivery, like it's like they're doing the 100 seconds you have to accept it, then it thinks I'm rejecting it, and then coming up with another one, and I can't see any of them. <laughs> I'm back at the McDonald's, I'm gonna use the toilet. Um, there's other delivery drivers here, so clearly some app is working, um, but oh, I'm so annoyed. Hopefully I'm gonna wait here for a bit and see if anything comes up on Uber. I have an update. So first of all, I've created a delivery group on Facebook. So I'll pop that down 
in the description at the top line go follow that um but i just asked him there i was like is anyone else's delivery down i was like it's literally buzzing and nothing's coming up um and everyone's saying yeah it's the same so delivery is down currently which is not ideal um so we're just on uber currently and waiting it's 127 i have nothing i've just asked in the group if uber eats is down because nothing is coming through on uber eats and there's quite a lot of delivery drivers parked here and they have nothing either surely both apps can't have gone down at the same time so the customer app of delivery is also down they've confirmed it on twitter i'm just speaking with people on facebook other delivery drivers and others are saying they're not getting uber eats orders too so i don't know if that's down all the delivery drivers are still here Surely they would have Uber Eats orders for McDonald's and so would I. 1.37. We're still here, nothing. I don't think Uber Eats is down. But no one's getting any orders. <laughs> this is such a fail. <laughs> I might just have a nap instead. I would say and then it'll beep when I get a delivery, but it keeps beeping on delivery and it's not a delivery. I think Uber Eats must be down as well because McDonald's has shut their delivery door and that means surely they have Uber Eats delivery and just eat and no drivers are going in and the door is shut. There must be a problem with everything. 10 to 2, nothing. So I'm driving to where Ben is and I'm just going to go watch his shows and walk around the like fun day area and then I'm going to continue filming tomorrow in Worthing. Right, so I will see you in Worthing in three, two, one. And just like that, we are back in Worthing. It is actually now the next day I did film during the heat wave, but it was so busy that I made it a separate video. So go check that out, that is out already. It's like delivering in a UK heat wave. Um, and I've just had some work done on my car yesterday, the couple of bits that were left on the advisories, and I've just picked up my car just now. So I'm just gonna turn the apps on and we're gonna do some deliveries together. I have a Just Eat shift. It's currently 9.34 in the morning and it is Thursday today. I've just turned on Just Eat. I'm rather hot from walking to the garage. Let's turn on Deliveroo. Oh, I've got Wi-Fi on. That's a little life hack. You need to turn off your Wi-Fi. Uber's on, 1.1 boost. And let's turn on Deliveroo. There it goes, Shane is not busy. But we are online and waiting. They're trying to send me on Uber to McDonald's in Shoreham, 20 minutes away, 6.8 miles. Absolutely not, you don't get paid to drive there. A B livery's also just come up, £12.97 to go 13.6 miles each way, so that's not worth it either. What's going on? An Uber, a Deliveroo and a Just Eat have all come up for Costa Coffee all at the same time. I'm like trying to turn them off and every single app has come up for. I've accepted the Just Eat but the Deliveroo is actually the best. I'll have to reject the Deliveroo. Deliveroo is 5.41 but I've already accepted the Just Eat so I'm going to have to do that one. So it is for £3.85 going 0 0.8 miles. Just need to drive 20 seconds down the road and we will be there. is complete and I got reimbursed 60p so that made it a £4.45 job instead of 3 85 so that's not actually as bad. Just making my way back to Christmas Parade area to wait. Oh, the Uber's coming through, bear with me. An Uber came up for us somewhere again in Shoreham which I'm five miles away from. Not sure why that's coming up if they're really that desperate for drivers maybe. Um, that's really thrown me off. Oh yeah, it was really strange how um, a Just Eat Uber and Deliveroo all came up at the exact same time, all for Costa. That was really strange. Maybe 
I don't know what time it was I accepted it, maybe around half nine, no, slightly later, quarter to ten. I don't think it would have been when their apps were turned on. They would have been open already. I don't know, it's strange. 11 minutes past 10 and we have an order on delivery for Costa Coffee for £3.15. So we're just going to drive back there. We've only got about 20 minutes till KFC opens and then we should be getting orders from there. The order is for six items, two lattes, a vanilla latte, cappuccino, another cappuccino and a bacon bat. Hopefully they're a bit quicker this time because I don't get paid any extra on delivery for the waiting time. We parked in the same place again. There's one ready, but that won't be mine. No, not my one. Order is collected and now we have three minutes, 0 0.8 miles to get to the customer. That was a lot less of a wait time that time. Uh, it was just like five minutes maybe, um, but there was six items. So that wasn't bad at all. and it is on Just Eat for Ren's Kitchen going a total of three miles for £5.92. I'm only a couple of minutes away um, so most of the distance will be driving to the customer. I've got roadworks on, I can't park anywhere. Order was already if it wasn't I was definitely gonna get food there because it looks absolutely amazing <laughs> they bake it fresh every day I now have 11 minutes 2.9 miles to get to the customer and it is going over Goring way We now have a double order on Just Eat. As soon as I ended this one, another one came up and it's for Bayleaf Cafe in Goring, which I'm currently about two minutes away from. And then uh, I'm not 100% sure on the miles in total, but the pay is for just over nine pounds, which is pretty good. One of them, I think I had a quick look, is for like three pound 20 and going really near. And then the other one is like five pound something or other I can't remember <laughs> It was a little over a 10 minute wait, so I might be rowing first like 20 or 40p. It was a little bit slow, um, but they're still fairly new to the apps. I think the business itself has been running for six years, but on deliveries, uh, I think it's very recent. Um, but they're friendly in there, so that's good. The first one is going six minutes, 1.9 miles away. So I think with the distances, it must have been, this one's the one that's going further and paying more. And then I assume it's the distance from that first customer to the second customer is why it's less, is what I am guessing. First one dropped off and I am right in saying that the second one uh, the distance isn't very far it's three minutes 0 0.6 miles away 
So um, that is how they pay then. I now can understand. I've only actually had a few double just eat orders. Um, but like I said, this one is paying from the distance from here to the next customer. Um, and there must be like a minimum pay of, I guess, around three pounds. I just have my headlights done at the garage um, to make them yet yellow and they look so nice now. It is 11 o'clock and I'm gonna head back to Broadwater area, get myself a drink and some food. Then I think I'm actually gonna go for a nap um, and then film another video as I'm feeling pretty tired. I've had a busy week. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. And I'll see you next Sunday at 10 a.m. with a new video. Bye.